Who is Paul writing to? People in the churches of Galatia. So he's, he's not, you know, standing in a gospel crusade and talking to unbelievers and he's not telling them, you're turning away from God. He is talking to believers in the church and he's saying, I'm shocked that you're turning away from God. Paul, they're coming to church. How can you say they're turning away from God? They're coming to church. See, in our minds, we think, hey, if I come to church, no, 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 I must be getting closer to God. Right? My relationship is right with God because I'm coming to church. I'm attending all the prayer meetings. I'm doing my Bible study. And yet Paul is writing to people that are sitting in churches and he's saying, I'm shocked that you are turning so soon from God. So in, in, when Paul is writing that, what, what, that, what that lets me know is this. You can be coming to church and yet be turning your life away from God. You can be sitting in church and yet your life may be turning away from God. Now, why does Paul equate this to turning away from God? He says, who called himself through you by his loving mercy in Christ. You are following a different way. You are following a different way that pretends to be the good news. In other words, what is the good news? The gospel. So he's saying you are following a different gospel that pretends to be the true gospel. So you can come to church, but if you're following a different gospel, according to Paul, which is the, which is the word of God, which is the, the truth for us today, he says, you can come to church, you can attend the prayer meetings, you can hold the Bible in your hand, you can have all the wall calendars in your uh, uh, home, you can have all the crosses, you can have all the pictures of Jesus and the, all the paintings and all of those things. But if you're, uh, uh, if you're following a different gospel, then you're turning away from God.